Hey you guys, it's Shamira aka Mimi. Let's get straight into it. It is Monday. So if you guys haven't already checked out the pick a card for today, please check that out as who is missing you and why. And also check out other motivational messages that I have dropped on my channel. Okay, if you guys are watching this from Instagram, please head over to the link in the bio. Okay, you definitely see my channel. Hit Talks with Mimi on YouTube. Okay, catch up on everything that you guys may have missed. All right. And also, um, yeah, you guys, I, I want to get more into giving you these messages throughout the week. Okay, some of you guys are like, what happened to you? Why you don't have the messages? Because I feel like I don't get a lot of engagement on Instagram. Okay, I feel like I get a little more engagement on YouTube. So if you guys want to check out these messages um, more often, please visit my YouTube channel. Okay, subscribe. Okay, like, share, subscribe, comment, interact with me, you guys, because I am definitely open to it. And also uh, this year, I, I am making a resolution to um, definitely put myself out here a little bit more okay interact with you guys a little bit more share more of my story with you guys and also um, give you guys more more advice okay I, I, I would like uh, more engagement okay so today's message is this is definitely for someone so if you guys are feeling the type of way or if you guys are a little offended by it it's not my intention to do so um, but this is definitely something I feel like I had to talk about because I see a lot of people doing this, okay? Um, this year should be uh, about not repeating last year's cycles, okay? So if any of you guys are really going through something traumatic, I wouldn't really say traumatic, but if you guys do it, okay, or perceive it as being traumatic, um, and if someone comes to you with a simple solution and you guys uh, turn it down, you may need to rethink that okay rethink turning suggestions down to certain uh solutions okay to your problems um some of you guys are going through a certain circumstance okay but when someone comes to you with a solution or or uh, a fix for it an answer for it, you guys are very i would say quickly uh leaning towards turning it down because it looks like hard work or it looks like uh, in order for you guys to get help or to fix the problem, you have to help someone else, okay? Sometimes, you guys, I'm not blaming anything on you guys, but some people suffer to receive some sort of sympathy and empathy from others, not really to fix it, okay? So are you actually, uh, I would say, suffering through a circumstance or are you keeping yourself there? Okay, this is all about my channel is all about taking accountability for yourself, your actions and for your life and not making excuses. It may not be in, in the most, I would say, uh, lighthearted way, but it's, it's definitely needed. Okay, it's definitely something that needs to be said because some of you guys kind of know you are kind of staying stuck in a situation where you don't have to. Okay, now I'm going to tell you guys something and that's real talk. You may or may not agree with me, but I feel like sometimes life teaches us uh, certain, I would say certain lessons, okay, of how stubborn we could be. Sometimes we're put in a certain circumstance to see how long we're, we're willing to stay in that circumstance, how willing we're, we're willing to, I would say, uh, suffer, okay, unnecessarily just because we don't want to help another person, okay? I, one particular thing I'm going to say, an example, is Habitat for Humanity. I see a lot of people out here complaining about housing and, and getting affordable housing and stuff like that. It's programs like a Habitat for Humanity who do not mind building a house for you, but the gig is you have to put in a few hours, okay? I think at least 100, 150 hours um, to help build someone else's house in order for you to get your own house built, okay? And some people are like, why would I do that if I'm in need? Why would I give when I'm in need? Sometimes um, life isn't about you, okay? And sometimes we are put in these situations to see how selfless and selfish we could be, okay? We are given the choice. We have that free will to choose and decide what, what we want to uh, get ourselves into or how to get ourselves out of it. But if we're choosing to be entitled, expecting people to just give us everything and get everything our way, and they have to give first before we in, 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 in before we even, I would say, entertain the thought of giving first, someone has to give to us first. And sometimes that sense of entitlement, okay? I'm going to say that sense of entitlement and people might not agree with me. Like I said, I know I'm going to get some backlash for this one. Okay. Is the reason why you guys are suffering and going through a certain circumstance. Maybe the lesson is for you to understand that you cannot be so self-absorbed. Okay. And entitled as, as you guys are. Okay. Sometimes we have to learn how to 
uh, start giving to other people and recognize that life is just about us and what makes us comfortable. It's about helping other people, okay? Helping other people feel comfortable in order for us to feel comfortable. And I know it may sound a little, I would say in some way, it, it may sound a little nonsense, but that, that that is just the way the world works sometimes, okay? And if you're worried about, okay, what if I give too much to the wrong people or for example, I've given too much to the wrong people in the past. You guys cannot hold on to a uh, bitterness and resentment from what other people have done to you or from past experiences and take that out on the other people around you who may need your help. And because you're going through something, you feel like, well, I'm in no position. I don't feel like I need to help anyone because no one's helping me. Okay. You guys have to stop doing that because everyone is not going to treat you how the past treated you. Sometimes your lesson is to uh, discern. Okay. Who is going to use you and who is not going to use you okay who uh doesn't need your help who actually needs your help are you learning a lesson have you discerned who needs your help you would not be put in a situation where you're going to get used again if you guys haven't learned from your lesson you understand what i'm saying if you learn from your lesson you won't get used okay next time you help someone but if you haven't learned from your lesson of course you're going to run into those type of circumstances where people are walking all over the top of you swindling you using you getting you with the okie doke okay have you learned that lesson? Sometimes we're put in certain circumstances to see if we actually learned the, the damn lessons that we were learning in the past. Okay, life is a series of tests. Okay, Trill, trials and tribulations. Okay, and we, we have to determine whether we're strong enough to get ourselves out of because only we have the power to get ourselves out of half the situations. It's all about our perception and our willingness to do so. Okay, so are you truly going through a circumstance? Are you truly suffering? because you're just suffering or are you keeping yourself there because you want to be stubborn okay so if you guys are feeling a little rebellious and, and you just refuse to get yourself out of the situation if, if it includes helping another person then i guess your ass going to stay stuck okay you're going to stay in that damn position for a very long time okay until you budge <laughs> okay sometimes we create our own suffering and i just have to be real and, and i was flipping through this deck and i really wanted to pull but I don't think that it's always necessary to uh, go to these these cards because it is a tool, okay? Not all, all the time I need to use a tool to, I would say, deliver a certain message. So if you guys got something from this message today, you know, take it for what it is, okay? Share it, definitely uh, allow other people to gain this message, specifically if you guys know a person who is willingly staying stuck in a situation or a circumstance they do not have to be in okay and um if you guys felt a certain type of way you guys felt insulted or offended once again it definitely was not my intention but maybe this is for a reason maybe you need to hear this to kind of uh get you moving and get you going out of your certain circumstance okay because some of you guys know you're stubborn as heck okay you know you're stubborn so um yeah allow this to soak in a little bit you ain't got to act on it right away but allow it to soak in share it with other people or just leave it all together and, and just i don't know you'll, you'll learn your lesson okay so thank you guys so much for vibing with me for watching hit the link in the bio shop heavily by goddess b for all your spiritual health needs and also check out my channel talk to me on youtube get that pick a card who's missing you and why and i definitely will see you guys next time okay Mwah. bye